the warmest of welcomes to you. We await the conclusion of the pre-game formalities. And here we have Marseille against Bordeaux. I'm Peter Drury, and this is Jim Beglin. A delight to have him on board. Hello, Peter, and hello to everyone watching. For me, it's a, it's a real thrill to be here. Starting lineups. on the way tries a through ball oh that's neat time to deliver swung over oh, he couldn't get the direction he needed and it all came from very good trickery in the, in the wider position but quite a static defence was pretty fortunate to survive that little episode it should have been much worse Just poorly executed. Diaby plays it out to the wing. Fence has got rid of that. So what now? Now the pass. Tries a header! Oh, the keeper's done ever so well. And that wasn't exactly a routine save. He still had an awful lot to do to keep that out. Superb. Tassil passes it through. Marseille have had plenty of possession, but few, if any, genuine chances. That's not going to make it. Forward it goes. Promising move that. Good inroads into enemy territory, but no joy. Like a good ball through. Oh, it's opened up nicely for him. He's dealt with that well. Has a pop! Oh, good effort. He got plenty on that. Yeah, and he knew he had to get his effort away before they closed down, but he could have sacrificed a little power then for a bit more accuracy. it out oh, the balls come loose and the chase is on and he's there to hoof it away pumps it upfield still rather frustratingly it is nil nil to slip it through Diaby wanders offside it's the root one option Had a look, and he's blown his whistle for half-time. Any opinion you'd like to express on the first half? 
I think it's been a very impressive defensive effort. They've never been broken down and contained the opposition attack extremely well. Interesting half, just missing goals. So don't be surprised if the second half brings a change to the scoreline at the break. Nil nil. And the action is back on the way. At least there's always a plus side to a scoreless half. Defences are doing what they should, and it's going to take good imagination to break the deadlock here. Alessandrini. Who's going to make this theirs? Casillo. Aim forward. Towards the hour mark, and still no goals. And now they can launch a counter. He's off on a marauding run. Shot a goal! Balls loose, who's getting there? A chance! Has a shot! He can pounce on that. It's a loose ball. Decent strike, kept it fizzing low. And he did so well to keep that down. That would have made life very difficult for the keeper. delivery and all it needed was a touch well look it's it's often the timing of the jump that dictates what you can do with any header and if you get it slightly wrong then you'll struggle but that was beautifully met it really was Bordeaux take the lead. Well, look, provided they don't go into panic mode, there's no reason as to why they can't get right back into this yet. It's come loose. Diaby. Oh, it's opened up nicely for him. Goal! Marseille are all square. Wonderful stuff, and it was all about quick thinking and even quicker feet, but you have to ask questions as to how he got through. And that has added a whole new complexion to the game. Yeah, it's always a dangerous time when you've just scored. You can easily lose focus and then bang, you peg back again. He's had a goal! Look, he's not going to need an invitation to smash him from that sort of range. And I just think it's risky business for a team to just sit there and watch him pull the trigger like that. It could fly in the top corner. It's been intercepted, and that will come to nothing. Diaby. It's Diaby. He's made sure that that won't get through. Game with so much to recommend it. Fabulous contest, but still no clear winner.
Yes, and what a battle this has been. Neither is showing any sign of backing off. It's a tribute to wonderful attitude to put everything they've got into attempting to gain that vital edge. He's made certain that won't get through. A long and direct. Boxing towards the front. Time is up, and there goes the whistle. Well, a game that had everything except a winner. Really watchable, and honours even. Well, what are your thoughts on today's game then, Jim? Well, there were times when they looked like winning it, and times when they looked like losing it, so they'll be reasonably happy to, to end up with what they've got. And with that, it's time for me to thank Jim Beglin and to wish you a very good evening.